When you talk about the revolving door of corruption, it's hard to find anything more egregious than the role Halliburton played in the Iraq war. It all started with the event in 2001, an event that Iraq had nothing to do with. But the Bush administration told the American people in the world that Iraq had weapons of mass destruction. And that claim, we'll call it, was used to justify the Iraq war. A war that resulted in the death of nearly half a million people. And it's hard to find anyone who benefited more than Halliburton. They not only got the contracts to build the military bases that would be used to bomb Iraq, but they got the contracts to then rebuild the country. Bridges, buildings, roads, schools, hospitals, paid to bomb them and paid to fix them. Billions and billions of dollars. Oh, and Halliburton's CEO from 1995 to the year 2000 was George W. Bush's vice president, Dick Cheney. And he still owned a ton of stock in Halliburton. And this is why I write books on how information is controlled and the history of fake news and make unit studies on the military industrial complex. Check out my private homeschool community and Cubs to Bears books.